Hey everyone. A couple of etard and go karts were gone fishing and asked me to uh, video some of the old cars. So here's one. An old Monte Carlo, big body. This was my brother's car for a while. And uh, can't see in there very well, but it had the swivel out seats where you pull the handle and swivel it out toward. The outside of the car, there's one of them right there. It's been here for a long time. I don't know what year model it is, but my brother does. I like that blue color. I wish it was complete. I'd love to have that driving. All right, let's look at some more stuff. I know what y'all want to see. Y'all want to see this. Yep, short wheelbase. Been a long time since this thing was on its own wheels. It's got trees growing in the back of it. See there? And lots of poison oak and ivy. I don't know what year model it was. I know it's pretty well gutted out. No front end, hardly. No engine. And it's got the usual rust. It's been all gutted out. So, I don't know. I don't remember much about it. Got a little bendy action on the front. And uh, old square body. That thing was a rust bucket, I think, when it came in here. Many, 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 many years ago. All right. Here's probably the oldest Datsun truck you've ever seen. I used to drive that around when I was a kid. I think I'm feeling ticks. Ah, it's just me itching. Yep. Datsun. There you go, 60 horsepower. Yeah. Yep. A little standard shift. Sixty whole horsepower. Focus camera. I don't know if I can open this door. Probably not. Whoa. Wasp attacking me. I ain't even done nothing. Alright. Let's see what else we can find. Old Firebird. Pretty sure it was a rust bucket. They brought it in. It's all rusted out. There's another old Dotson truck. One of a few that my brother had. Check out the way the rest has done it. Isn't that trippy? There's an old four wheel drive. Square, more of a square Datsun. Datsun by Nissan. The other one of my brother's truck. And there's what I want out of the bunch. Trans Am. That's the one I want. One of these days I'll make a deal with my bro and get it. 37 Chevrolet. Two door. They used to call it the old stove bolt. That's what those were called. It would be complete, but I took it apart and was starting to work on it years ago and uh, never did get terribly far I see uh, if you look at that frame that's the frame to it and uh, that's a that's a pinto wagon front end rack and pinion with disc brakes that I put on it but that's as far as I got now I get over here so you can see the uh, so you can see the grill 
And that's just the rear end. I don't remember what kind of rear end that is. Might be... I don't know. I, I can't remember. I can't remember what kind of rear end I put on it. There's the grill. Isn't that beautiful? Look at that. I see that block laying there? That's a 400 small block. It was blowed up. That's why it come out. There's part of the old front end right there. Six bolts. There's the front, one of the front fenders. Driver's side front. Isn't that gorgeous? And the door's laying over there. Anyway. 37 Chevrolet. Really cool. I got to get it up my house one day. I want to put it on some kind of frame because I don't think I want to use that one. There's my dad's old trailblazer. Yep, there's the Trans Am. Look at this beauty. I think this is a 66 Fury 3. That's my brother's. Two door. Beautiful. I got the hood to it up my place. He had all kinds of engines to put in it. I wish they'd have got it going. That's one of my favorite cars that he had. I like it better than I like his Challenger. That is just one sexy... That is one sexy car right there. Look at that thing. Isn't that gorgeous? I'm afraid to get in these because I don't want to get eat up. Can't really see in there. But the, the, the seats are all there. This car didn't have a motor in it when he got it. But it was complete. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? All right. What else we got here? Oh yeah, Plymouth. I don't know the story on this car. I just can't remember it. Valari. I think that's a. I think that's a Charger. That that car don't have an engine. I don't know if this car does. It probably does. It probably ran. Most of these drove in here. With the exception of this one, I, I don't think it had an engine in it. Look at this boat over here. Look at that boat. Talking about an aircraft carrier. Look at that. Chrysler New Yorker. Yep. Brome. Look at that. Yep. They don't build them like this no more. Uh, I'm trying to see if... Yeah. I'm afraid to open that door. Yeah. Have a look in there. Yeah. Look at those seats. I bet they were so comfortable in their day. Close this. Prepare to run just in case. Looks like somebody's pried the hood open on it. Stowed the carburetor. That's a big block under there. I bet he don't know that either. Anyway. See, that's a nice two-door body. I still say that's the prettiest one. All right. There's a uh, two-stroke hovercraft. It actually ran. We had it running. That's called a scat. Scat hovercraft. I like a 40-horse two-stroke on it. Yeah. We were going to... Uh, We were going to put new bags on it. You have to replace those bags. And uh, it kept getting pushed to the back of the... It kept getting pushed to the back of the line. And 
and then uh, before we could get it done dad passed away so he kind of never got done now I'm going to show you something else because I know y'all we had talked about it some of you guys knew it I talked about dad having a 455 Oldsmobile and a square body Chevrolet well there it lays right there it's covered but I know it's full of water really shame he made for one wicked power plant for a square body and then that is the original I think it's a 94 Dodge Stealth it's got 8,000 miles on it this is my mom's my dad bought it for my mom it's locked or I'd show you the inside it's brand new in there it's got a three liter six cylinder in it but it's, yeah it's like 8,000 miles that's not an exaggeration it's 8,000 miles so anyway you guys wanted to see vehicles well there they are that's uh besides the one more thing the ridiculously short motorhome the almost what's the use motorhome it's a I believe it's a 318 but look how close the wheels are together it's like almost like what's the use dad bought that thing got it running got it driving it ran perfect I'm afraid to know what it looks like now inside dad could make anything run anyway that's the uh, that's the toys hope you guys enjoyed the power tour <laughs> all the goodies because uh that's pretty much it. There's one of my dad's old wreckers. He used to use this back before back before they got too crazy with the rules. He owned a bunch of cars with that piece of junk. He was weak as all get out. But it would go. Almost forgot. Jaguar. Jaguar XJS HE V12. This car was in great shape. We got it at a dealership years ago. It was running and driving just fine. And uh, they was getting ready to paint it up and it got pushed to the back. A massive engine under there. It's a pretty cool old car. Really good acceleration. Smooth. Alright, have a good day.